All right, so here today we have a bunch of things to talk about, a bunch of things to go over, so I hope you guys are ready for this. If you're new to the channel, like and subscribe, it helps out a ton. Uh, we got a lot to go through, so uh, buckle in and prepare yourselves for uh, what we got. So yeah, like and subscribe, helps out a ton also. And uh, thank you guys for 5.6K, I truly appreciate it. Uh, we're talking about here today the changes, bug fixes, big improvements, and uh, systems. Also, exclusive gift codes are now here, so let me share those with you uh, so you are aware, or at least how to get them. Yes, also, just to make this clear, I want to say thank you, everyone, for supporting me. It truly means the world to me. As the title says, exclusive gift codes we now have multiple gift codes we have wave three and wave four officially given uh codes to us from netmarble huge w thank you netmarble for the hookup here uh but yes both the codes are huge actually huge so first code is a thousand acid stones for people so yes we have a code uh or a crap ton of codes to give away an insane amount uh, so i can hook up most of my supporters almost all of them basically right uh so be prepared, uh, prepared for that we also have rune fragment times 20 uh plus gold times thirty thousand. both of these codes have been officially provided to us uh by at marble we're going to be giving them away soon uh, make sure to check in your dashboard constantly i'm still giving away wave two so again i'll do all the work i've just been a little bit backlogged because again of the latest update but uh you have time to redeem them so again don't worry about it uh check your dashboard obviously as soon as you get each one of these codes and you've redeemed all four codes you have to wait then until five and six you can't get multiple of these codes and redeem them uh, so remember that's how this process works on top of that they've officially added a new function over here to the support dashboard uh, called extend support correct if you want to choose to support me into the next season also as season one is now officially coming to a close as i told you it would uh if you want to extend support please consider doing so and uh if you would like to go to your dashboard hit extend support and i can again continue to hook you up with codes but it truly means the world to me also and again we'll give some more codes away on videos and such uh, for giveaways so even if you can't support me it's all good you can still win a code again every 100 subscribers we're going to be giving away a bunch of codes uh we give about 20 to 25 codes per 100 subscribers so uh yeah where we just recently hit 5.6 as soon as we hit 5.7 i'll give away 20 25 of these codes uh so yeah stay tuned for that but with that being said always check your pay, uh page basically to see if you want anything go over here go to my page once you're logged in go to the supporter tab scroll, uh, scroll to the bottom see if you have a code and again if you don't get a code drop your id below that's always how i say to do it if you would like to get some of these codes but yeah thank you all for the support thank you for everything if you choose to support me further or extend your support i consider doing so if you want to drop a comment saying hey go go extend the support let me know it would mean the world to me so yeah, yeah. Let's hop into the video, though. Uh, with that being said, let's go into this. Um, improvements and changes. Custom draw lineup added. Officially, they've added Silver Main and they've added Scotty to the custom draw lineup pool, uh, which is very sick. Again, a nice little uh, kind of W for the player base. Because, again, if you want to dupe out Silver Main or at least obtain him, you now have that chance, right? So, again, he is a very powerful character. People would still consider him a top tier character. And, again, he is a really good support character for Jin Wu. So, remember, he is now there. So, make your decisions if you want to, you know, get him. Uh, or if you would rather just save for somebody else. But it is a massive, massive W that we do have this. So, I'll take that as, a, as something sick. So, there is that. Uh, not only that, again, Scotty is there. We'll take some uh, time to break down the weapon and check it out. But... Um, for the most part, it is looking pretty good so far. It is looking pretty good so far. Stop saying Grimoire is dead. Or uh, Grimoire. Grimoire. Stop saying Grimoire is dead. <laughs> I've seen so many comments saying, oh, Rip Grimoire, uh, as a joke. No, it's not dead. It should be, it should be still good. Uh, we have this also here, balance adjustments. Balance adjustments for certain, uh, hunters and weapons will be adjusted. We already went through that in a separate video. Check that out on the channel if you would like to. But over here, we have Baruka skill. When summoning shadows, the number of times the ground area range skill that explodes sequentially to generate it will be reduced. So there you go. Number one thing over here. Ice Elf Guard Captain includes mutant monsters within the story content skill. Uh, certain tornado skills will be adjusted, reducing pursuing speed, huge, increased hit frequency, reduced damage, reduced duration. The tornado skills will be uh, sustained as before. Um, what is it? What is it? Below will be sustained as before the balance adjustment. Battlefield of Trials, no changes in damage and duration. And mutant monster, no changes in damage. So basically just for story it's nerfed correct yeah just for story content uh they also launched a bunch of new bundles a lot of them actually being really good in value uh, if you do consider purchasing anything i still always recommend the battle pass very good purchase and um i haven't taken a look into this yet but it's basically this is free this is free so two free packs then you have to purchase a pack over here i gotta check the cost for this right but um this should be a dollar right it's only it's only one custom draw ticket then free this should also be a dollar free diamond 740 10 so like well this should be like 15 bucks maybe max nothing more than that free and then like 20 bucks 25 bucks and then free that's what it should be right so i'll check this but um i haven't heard any complaints about anything yet uh, they also updated the uh the other total rewards the total payouts like the, the, the rewards right it is pretty good it gives you a grimoire by the way watch your 
not bad and choy so there is that um a bunch of other things bunch of uh common notes for all packages um new product pretty basic stuff here so here we go system improvements let's zoom in for this one uh decrease the difficulty of extreme evasion okay improve to ensure that the usage of sung jin woo and hunter's skill is not disrupted in certain circumstances when playing story content improved the description in the power of destruction info added a pop-up where you can select the gamepad control type in the game tile screen very cool very cool deleted certain effects and skills that black sung jin woo use it his name is Black Sun Jing Wu in that in that thing. Uses in the Sung Jin Wu job qu change quest. Wait, they call him. They literally call him Black Sung Jin Wu. <laughs> Yo, throwback to the 70s. Black Meliodas, dude. Remember that? They, they could have called him like Dark Meliodas. They call him Black Meliodas. Um, okay, yeah. I think I, I don't know if that's like I don't know if that's what they were talking about. That thing over there. But um, I think that's what it is, right? The, the, the thing you fight. Um, that shadow thing. We thought, it was, we thought it was Shadow Jinwoo or something like that. I called it. Improves certain monsters, attack methods, and effects appearing in side chapters or certain stories. Okay. Improved to properly apply the display resolution of the Netmarble Launcher PC. Mm hmm. Improved caution description of special summons. Don't want caution description, like the warning of what you're doing before you summon. Improved to be able to claim all the event mission rewards at once that could be achieved without uh, without limits. Very cool. Very cool, very cool. Improved hunter skill use sequences more smoothly in auto mode. We need that. Details regarding the burn effect will be added to the Encore missions and Gatekeeper of Hell's uh, dog info. The effect that was applied before and only these will be added when the debuff is stacked a certain number of times to deal significant damage to the entry party improve the so just details regarding it has been added so not that they've done anything to it improve the display conditions for the in-game red dot bug fixes fix the issue where the tutorial could not um proceed in certain circumstances or situations fix the issue where the security error um, occurred when attempting to log in under un, uh, unstable network conditions fix the issue where hunters were unable to attach images when using customer support on ios devices improved some description text fixed abnormal display issues in certain interfaces uh fix the intermittent issues where text or sorry where test text was displayed on the option screen fix certain descriptions in the battlefield of trials fix the artifact lock feature to apply normally fix the ornament uh, intermittent issues where the qte skills could not be used during basic slash core attacks when using gun type weapons fix the issues where cha uh, in the hunter preview was unable to proceed in certain circum uh, certain circumstances or again situations fix the intermittent issues um where certain chapters were unable to proceed fix the issue where on a reason skill uh, would not activate properly in certain again situations fix the issue where sung jin Wu's job change quest did not proceed properly in certain situations fix the issue where the animation screen was displayed abnormally when obtaining choi again um in the draw uh fix again the issues with the um or where some weapon skills were not activated properly fixed these uh the issue where hunter support skills did not activate properly in certain situations fix the issue where lichen slayer hit less than intended when using fix the issue where red main lichen it didn't appear in some uh, some cases when changing bosses during instance dungeon steel fanged like in content holy hell so many fixes <sighs> let's keep going fix the issue where certain effects of yo jino um advanced but tier 5 would not apply, apply properly uh fix the issue where certain effects of the blessings those would not apply normally fix the issue where the name rank heroic has been displayed inconsistently in certain situations oh my god holy hell a lot of fixes a lot of system improvements over here but yeah they haven't really fixed the uh current issue <laughs> the solo loading arise uh the entire loading thing they still haven't really addressed that either because if you look if you look at it right uh here we go just just a she just a c can't speak click this over here let's go to this event tab oh wait a minute never mind there it is right okay here we go let's go to each one of these okay currently we're kicking currently we're kicking let's get back to the main menu go over here there it is. <laughs> oh, you can always see him. He, hey, if anybody's gonna ever not be there for you, remember this will always be there for you. Remember, till the end of time, that will always be there. Right? You think you're all alone? No. This solo loading indicator will always be there. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah it's still not fixed someday they'll get to this one but hey that's all i got for you here today hope you guys enjoyed the video again exclusive gift codes i now have gonna start giving them away soon check your dashboards and um yeah thank you all for the support thank you all for everything and i'll see you guys soon with some more uh solo leveling arise videos so yeah thank you